July 3rd, 2012. Guest writer. Chris Owens, Executive Director, Indiana Park and Recreation. Title of the article, Recreation, Relaxation, and Renew. First and foremost, it is an honor to write on behalf of many of the parks and recreation professionals throughout our fine state. July is National Park and Recreation Month, and although my opinion is biased, I believe Indiana has some of the best opportunities for recreation, exercise, and play in nature and throughout the country. A little background about our association and those whom we serve. What we now know as Indiana Park and Recreation Association has evolved over the years from what began in 1916 as the Indiana Association of Parks Departments. The park and recreation movement of the early part of the 1900s was begun in part due to a need for improved public Today, our association serves over 800 Indiana-based professionals by providing continuing education, advocacy, networking opportunities, and professional resources so they can best serve their public. One thing I've learned as I travel the state, tour facilities, and interact with our members is that parks professionals are in general good people. They care about their communities, the environment, and providing a safe place for play and relaxation. What we do is fun is a common theme running through our professional events and provides great perspective as our members seek to provide even more opportunities to create. Recreation or Recreation is defined by the World Dictionary as World English Dictionary as a verb meaning to create anew or reproduce. Society seemingly pulls so much time and energy these days with increasing demands that I believe the quality of life is tied directly to the opportunities we give ourselves to relax play, and exercise essentially renew our state of mind through physical activity. What comes to mind when you think about parks? What smells do you think of? What sounds do you hear? For me, it's an image of children playing, smelling freshly cut grass, and sounds of laughter. For you, it will likely be different. That's true beauty of parks in my mind. They can be so many different things to so many different people. For some who read this article, trails, greenways, and the opportunity to utilize them may provide that opportunity to enjoy the outdoors. Governor Daniels has been very active advocating for trails. Under his leadership, the Hoosiers on the Move plan was developed to have a trail located within 15 minutes of every Hoosier citizen by 2016. Others may find their opportunity to play at their local park pool or splash pad. Legislation and code changes over the past few years have made these features safer and more accessible thus providing more people the essential opportunity to play. Our state has many wonderful aquatic facilities. I encourage everyone to explore, especially during these warm summer months. If the outdoors isn't appealing, then consider some of the youth and adult programs many park and community centers provide. You'll find classes and workshops 
for everything from arts and crafts to math, science, sports, literature, and more. Programs are typically seasonally based and information is readily achievable and accessible through your local parks department. These are just a few options and there are certainly many other ways to enjoy nature, learn, and play. The bottom line is to allow time to pursue the opportunity to relax and renew. Parks provide a great venue to do just that. See you in the parks.